Inclination is a great tool. Whenever you're doing high angle shooting, it is something that you obviously need to apply to your shot. Um, it often gets applied when you use one of our connected laser range finders. So anytime you connect to one of our long list of connected laser range finders, a lot of them will send in not only your distance and your direction of fire, but they also send in your inclination. We see a lot of people that leave inclination on by mistake, and I'm gonna to talk to you about how to fix that and how to recognize that it's happening. When you go into target screen, if you hit TGT, center button to go in, scroll down until you see the I degree or I cosine. They're tied together, so whichever one you move is going to adjust the other one. Um, if it's not set to plus zero for the I degree and 1.00 for the cosine, then you have an inclination added onto your Kestrel. To remove it, just scroll to the left or the right to adjust it. When you exit back out, your Kestrel will now have a small asterisk next to the distance at your TGT. That's indicating that something has been messed with inside of your target, and it gives you a good reminder that you have inclination applied. The most common time this happens is when somebody uses the connected laser rangefinder, ranges a target, and then their buddy calls out the next distance. Easiest way to change your distance is scroll through with the Kestrel to adjust it, and that's gonna leave that inclination in there. So make sure whenever you see an asterisk that you know that you can go back into your Kestrel, remove it down to zero, and remove that inclination.